South African captain A.B. de Villiers comes to the crease averaging 49 6,000 runs with his team on 172 for two that's the end of the over 172 for two de Villiers on strike yet to get off the mark off the mark now and de Kock on strike left to right hand combination maintained because de Kock has played beautifully extra bounce the South African batsmen have made this pitch look easy but believe me there's more than enough there to encourage the bowlers oh! yeah most evident when the new batsmen come in Callis is not shabby as a player neither is A.B. de Villiers and it's been a bit difficult for both of those when they've walked out there it's done well a bit I feel it not to show what the song is probably a blast from the past and the runs are continuing as well play and intended to go that straight just a single Oi! we'll talk a bit more about that yep about this surface and what a good score is on here South Africa now 207 for two we we'll look to address that as this comes to an end final 10 overs of the innings couple of runs to start off in this 41st over So coming back to your earlier point about when you have resources, the key is to put your resources in positions where they can benefit the team the best. And that is beautifully struck at this time by A.B. de Villiers. It runs away to the boundary. That is just a quality stroke. Yeah, I said he'd look to address that strike rate scenario in a couple of shots. He's gone to a runner ball. Beautiful use of the feet. He's nimble. And he gets to it and he places it perfectly as well in the middle of the bat and beats long on and that'll be a few more four more two in a row so this is where ms Dhoni has some problems he has got options as far as bowlers is concerned but not enough seamers under these conditions he's got to rely on the spinners and this is a pretty difficult pitch to bowl spin on the pitch then. looking to try and get at him then changed his mind to Villiers and got onto one knee and swept crack that he's cracked that very hard indeed brilliant shot from A.B. de Villiers yes quality shot from A.B. de Villiers Middorf is up in the circle so that is an area that he might look to target he's come down there again he's advanced down but it wasn't a half body or any man it means it was dragged down and he's gone through with the shot the timing was superb there was a man on the sweeper boundary but he barely had a chance to move it really was off the middle of the bat but he's a very dangerous customer at this stage of an innings I think it's uh, quite clear what AB's intent is. There's plenty of options for the right-handed De Villiers to take on. Squeezed away, back with a square. He's going to want to come back for the second. He does. Just talking about those options, we've seen De Villiers in the years gone by. He's very adaptable. Clever again, there's a man down there. That's one of the four allowed outside the circle now. In the old days, you're allowed one more, but just four now. That's what Sean's talking about, the challenge that is provided to the bowlers. The game's changed, there's no doubt about that. Particularly in India, we've seen the way India have played at home. In deliveries. 
De Villiers is middle dead. Yes, it's all the way. A low full toss there. But Abe De Villiers with the power he possesses. It didn't bother him in the slightest. Absolutely crunched that. And it cleared the boundary with ease. Certainly not out of the middle. Boundaries are not small, the Wanderers. It won't be called a wide in a normal situation it would have been, but AB certainly waltzed across wide outside the off stump. This is outstanding stuff from AB. 50 runs between these two and just 27 balls. It's gone again. This time over, extra cover, and that's half a dozen more. That is a beautiful shot from A.B. de Villiers. Yes, another quality one. And that brings up 50 for A.B. de Villiers. 52 of 38 deliveries. He's gone there with two sixes in this over. And as we've said before, he can really be very destructive, Ken de Villiers, at this stage of an innings, particularly when he finds himself in. And here's an example. Four fours, two sixes, 38 deliveries. And he slid the crease, hoping to take this a little bit further. So that's the first time in 17 games that they've gone past the 300 mark South Africa. With De Villiers doing that in style. And it's just got to do with the bowling. If you're going to go for that York, you've got to get it in there. If it's a low dipping full toss, you'll get punished. On this occasion, that's length. And that the wonders we've seen, if you get any decent bat contact, there's a good chance you'll clear the fences. And his protection on the bounce. Beautifully struck by AB. Yeah, it's actually another one he's got away with. Oh, he's cracked that. It's another terrific shot from AB to Villiers. It's on the bounce. It's another boundary. Once again, length at the end here from the Indian bowlers. And Mohit on this occasion decides to try and bang it in back of a length. The Villiers in this farm form is not going to miss out on these opportunities. Here we go. It's a length delivery. He just frees up his arms, middles it baseball style. No one at midwicket. There's a huge gap there for him to aim at. And he pulls it off. This really is going to give India some serious headaches for the rest of this one day series. They really have been pretty poor at the death here. We often talk about South Africa and how they haven't got it right at the death when they've been bowling over the last couple of years, but this is uh, certainly not good. Advancing down the track this time, and he sliced that away for another half a dozen. These exits, these uh, umpires are going to need some uh, some massaging, I think, at the break. They have sore shoulders shortly. Richard Elliwood had a sore back before the start of play, so interesting there. De Villiers once again moving down the wicket. Give himself a little bit of room, opens the face, knows that there's no one back at third man. So if he gets the open face and gets the bat on ball, there's a good chance to go for a boundary. He gets better contact than probably expected. And that's flown the whole way for another six. And now 17 runs from this over. It's been an outstanding way to finish. Two balls remaining. And this the 49th. Full toss this time, he's hammered that nice and straight. And he's got it away for another boundary. Superb, absolutely superb. There's not much more you can say, it's just really good cricket here from Aby de Villiers. Got it alone, the bat. Didn't get the sort of contact he was really after. But it was still good enough, straight over the bowler's head. Shikadavan tries to make as many yards as he can. Darbs gets a hand at it, but it's in vain. Another boundary. No one's going to go speak to the bowler. We haven't seen any of the players go. No captain. No one's going to go discuss what line, what length. Whether they should be bowling yorkers or slow balls. Stand is worth 96. He's got that one over the keeper. Maybe he's going to be very quick and scamper back for the second. That's going to take the stand to 98. And yet again, it's been a brilliant over from the home team. for four in fact it's gone for six that brings up the hundred stand what a magnificent performance from these two Shami just sits there in disbelief what more can I do 
What must I do? De Villiers comes across the crease, gets underneath it. We've seen him do this on a couple of occasions in T20 cricket, a couple of times in one-day cricket as well. So versatile, he knows how to score all around the wicket. Here we go. He moves across, it's dragged down a length, he just gets underneath it and watches with success. Got big on him, but still gets enough bad contact on it to take it the whole way. His team are loving it, absolutely loving it. And it was a delivery of 140 k's per hour. He's got him this time. The length was right, the accuracy was spot on, and that's the result. Yeah, Shami has been the pick of the bowlers, so he deserves wickets. And his length at the, at the death here hasn't been ideal. But on this occasion, the Villiers going across again, trying to emulate the last delivery. And Shami got this a touch fuller. You miss, I hit the stumps. That's what you've got to do at the end. And he's brought about some success. Look at this, nice and full, almost pitching on the white line. Knocks over the off stump. Brings to an end. A wonderful end by A.B. de Villiers. He's on his way. South Africa, 352 for four.